Step into the time-woven tapestry of memory, where the glow of the screen dances upon the canvas of recollection. Cast your mind back to that serendipitous moment when the world of Knot's Landing unfurled before your eyes like a hidden treasure map waiting to be deciphered. Do you recall the tingling anticipation as the first notes of the theme song enveloped you? a melodic gateway into a realm of suburban intrigue and human complexities. Perhaps it was Valene Ewing's indomitable spirit that captured your heart, her journey a symphony of resilience amidst heartaches. Or maybe it was the enigmatic Karen Fairgate's struggles that resonated with your own, her pursuit of happiness a mirror to your aspirations. In this tapestry, there was Gary, Abby, Richard, and Laura, their lives, like threads, intricately weaving together, forming a tableau of unforgettable stories. Reflect, if you will, on those nights when the unraveling dramas left you perched at the edge of your seat, a roller coaster of emotions in the most exquisite way. Moments etched in memory, scenes that swayed like leaves in the wind, some poignant, others heart pounding, but all woven into the fabric of your own history. And so, as we journey back to that nostalgic corner of the past, let us illuminate the present with a sprinkle of random facts about the show. Discover the origins of its inception, the actors who breathed life into its characters, and the behind-the-scenes anecdotes that add color to the stories you cherished. So, dear traveler through time and memory, are you ready to rediscover the labyrinthine streets of Knott's Landing? Let the stage be set, the spotlight unfurled, for the revelations that await. Step into the world where lives entwine, secrets unfurl, and fates are spun, Knott's Landing beckons, once again, to captivate hearts anew, it hearts anew, it hearts anew. Overview, Knott's Landing, a renowned TV series that premiered in 1979, stands as a spin-off of Dallas, showcasing a distinct narrative that delved into the lives of suburban families. Set in a fictional Californian community, the show explored the intricate dynamics of relationships, personal ambitions, and the pursuit of dreams. Its origins trace back to David Jacobs, who envisioned it as a vehicle to depict the stories of middle-class characters in a less opulent context compared to Dallas. Iconic characters, the series boasted a diverse ensemble cast, including characters like Karen and Mac Mac Kenzie, played by Michelle Lee and Kevin Dobson respectively, who served as emotional anchors amidst the turbulence of their community. Valene Ewing, portrayed by Joan Van Ark, became a fan favorite with her evolution from a timid housewife to a strong-willed entrepreneur. The charismatic and enigmatic Abby Cunningham, portrayed by Donna Mills, added a layer of intrigue to the show's narrative, embodying both ambition and manipulation. Unique style, Knott's Landing set itself apart with its character-driven storytelling that emphasized emotional complexity over high-stakes drama. Unlike its parent show Dallas, which focused on corporate intrigue, Knott's Landing delved into the intricacies of personal relationships, tackling themes of infidelity, loyalty, and personal growth. Its format also allowed for longer character arcs and exploration of social issues. Impact on popular culture, the show left an indelible mark on popular culture by pioneering the serialized drama format, which would later become a staple in television. Its realistic portrayal of domestic life resonated with audiences, making it a relatable and engaging experience. Knott's Landing inspired future TV series to explore the depth of interpersonal relationships, setting a precedent for shows that centered on character-driven narratives. Main content, random facts about Knott's Landing. Initially intended as a miniseries, the show's popularity led to its continuation for 14 seasons. Donna Mills' character, Abby, is often remembered for her power suits and scheming ways. In a notable crossover, J.R. Ewing from Dallas appeared on Knott's Landing, bridging the two series. The series finale in 1993 provided closure to long-running storylines, satisfying fans. Joan Van Ark's portrayal of Valene earned her a devoted fanbase and a spin-off series titled Valey. Conclusion, Knott's Landing stands as a groundbreaking series that redefined TV storytelling, focusing on the intimate lives of suburban families. With its distinctive characters and emphasis on relationships, the show's impact on popular culture and legacy endures, leaving behind a lasting imprint on the television landscape. 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 Don Murray's departure sparks controversy in Knott's Landing in the annals of television drama. Few series have captured the hearts of viewers quite like Knott's Landing. 
Premiering in 1979, the show quickly became a staple in households across the nation, weaving a captivating tale of suburban life replete with secrets, betrayals, and shifting alliances. Yet, beneath the glossy veneer of primetime entertainment, behind-the-scenes struggles occasionally threatened to overshadow the on-screen drama. One such instance emerged at the inception of the third season, when the departure of Don Murray, a central figure in the show's ensemble cast, sent shockwaves through the production. Reports diverge on the reason for Murray's exit. Some cite his desire to explore new horizons in his career, while others contend that a contract dispute led to his sudden departure. The tumultuous situation ignited debates among fans and industry insiders alike, shining a spotlight on the intricate negotiations that underpin even the most beloved shows. Murray's character, Sid Fairgate, had become an integral part of the Knot's landing fabric, his presence interwoven with the lives of other characters. His departure left a void that would eventually be filled, but not without consequences. The writers, seemingly in an attempt to rekindle the show's signature blend of romance, Intention initially explored the notion of an extramarital affair involving Sid's wife Karen Fairgate, portrayed by Michelle Lee and Anne Matheson, a character played by Michelle Phillips. However, the idea hit a roadblock when Lee voiced her concerns about destabilizing the only seemingly stable couple in the show. She appealed to David Jacobs, the show's creator, who reportedly responded, There has to be one stable couple on the show. Consequently, the extramarital affair storyline was abandoned, and Phillips, who had been under contract, found her character written out of the show for a number of seasons. Phillips' eventual return in 1990 marked a rekindling of the Knot's Landing narrative, albeit with a recalibrated trajectory. Anne Matheson's character, once poised to pursue an affair with the married Mac Mac Kenzie, remained dormant, highlighting the intriguing interplay between creative vision and the realities of maintaining the integrity of a long-running series. As the show navigated these intricate behind-the-scenes challenges, its allure on screen continued to captivate audiences, leaving an indelible mark on the landscape of television drama. The legacy of Knott's Landing endures as a testament to the dedication of its creators, actors, and the intricate web of storytelling that resonated across generations. Generations. In a curious twist of narrative symmetry, the 1979 TV series Knott's Landing echoed a significant plot development from its parent show, Dallas, before it was even conceived. Prior to writer Peter Dunn's decision to delve into Linda Gray's alcoholic storyline on Dallas, the creative minds behind Knott's Landing orchestrated a parallel arc. Ted Shackelford's character embarked on a hauntingly similar journey of addiction, ingeniously synchronized with the chilling event of Sidgy's murder. This clever coordination between the shows added a layer of interwoven complexity, enhancing the viewers' engagement as they navigated the intersecting fates of two distinct series. While the synergy between Knott's Landing and Dallas remained an intricate tapestry, another thread of connection wove through the ensemble cast. The accomplished Bruce Greenwood, renowned for his portrayal of Democrat U.S. President John F. Kennedy in 13 days, found himself in the company of William DeVay. The latter had also depicted JFK in the Missiles of October. Remarkably, these two accomplished actors both embraced the role of the iconic American president and, serendipitously, found themselves collaborating on the enduring drama of Knott's Landing. Their combined talents lent an air of gravitas and shared history to the show, further solidifying its place in the annals of television. Amidst the intricate web of relationships and intrigue that define Knott's Landing, personal revelations emerged during the candid moments of a reunion special. Michelle Lee, a central figure in the series, bared an unexpected truth. She openly admitted to nurturing a crush on Kevin Dobson during his induction into the show's cast. This revelation, shared in the Knott's Landing reunion, together again, provided fans with an endearing glimpse behind the scenes, where the chemistry that pulsed on screen found its echoes in the hearts of the performers themselves. As the 1979 TV series Knott's Landing unfurled its tales of love, deception, and ambition, it unknowingly echoed the narrative strides of its parent show, brought together actors who shared a presidential bond, and unveiled the genuine affections that simmered beneath the glossy surface. Such intricate layers continue to remind us of the captivating legacy woven by the series, forever entwined in the tapestry of television history.
Interwoven fate, Knott's Landing's ties with Dallas explored in the realm of 1979 television. The gripping drama Knott's Landing emerged as a resounding success, captivating audiences with its intricate plot lines and compelling characters. Amidst the compelling narratives and emotional turmoil, a lesser-known connection between Knott's Landing and another production of its time comes to light. Steve Cahan, a familiar face to fans of Knott's Landing, embarked on a unique journey within the realm of TV drama. Not only did he leave an indelible mark as a series regular, but he later resurfaced as a distinct character in the series Behringer's. Interestingly, Behringer's shared a common thread with Knott's Landing, as both were brought to life under the auspices of Lorimer Productions. The creative force behind Behringer's, Diana Good, occupied a pivotal role as the executive story consultant of Knott's Landing, crafting numerous episodes that became intrinsic to the show's allure. Yet, beyond mere production connections, the storyline of Knott's Landing yielded a captivating interplay with another iconic TV series, Dallas, from which it spun off. The early seasons of Knott's Landing displayed a seamless narrative link with Dallas, contributing to the rich tapestry of both series. It's worth noting that Gary and Val, central characters of Knott's Landing, graced the final episode of Dallas in 1991. In a mesmerizing twist, an angelic apparition granted J.R. Ewing a glimpse into an alternate reality, one in which his presence had never graced the world. This cameo appearance unveiled the divergent lives of Gary and Val, underscoring the profound ties between the two series. Amidst the evolving narrative arcs and character developments, the kidnapping storyline stands as a testament to the dedication of the cast. Michelle Lee, the actress who breathed life into Karen Fairgate Mackenzie, underwent an unexpected hair transformation. The reason? The kidnapping storyline necessitated Karen's drastic haircut, mirroring Michelle Lee's real-life change between seasons. Knott's Landing, a show etched into the annals of television history, captivated audiences not only with its riveting tales, but also with its intricate connections to other productions of its era. The convergence of characters, the meticulous web of storylines, and the dedication of the cast unveiled a multifaceted world that continues to resonate with fans to this day. Engrossing and enthralling, Knott's Landing remains a testament to the captivating power of storytelling, where the tendrils of connection between characters and series carve a lasting legacy in the realm of television drama. As we lower the curtain on this journey through the captivating world of Knott's Landing, it's clear that this timeless TV series has woven itself into the fabric of our lives. Like the intricate interplay of its characters' relationships, the show's impact has left an indelible mark on the tapestry of television history. As you've delved into the lives, loves, and dramas of those who called Seaview Circle home, you may have found yourself mirroring their struggles, joys, and growth. Perhaps you've discovered your own reflections in the depths of their stories, reminding us that despite the decades that separate us from the show's inception, the human experience remains beautifully complex and universal. Knott's Landing wasn't just a show, it was an invitation to explore the nuances of human connections, to feel the ebbs and flows of emotions, and to witness the resilience of those who navigate life's challenges. And now, dear reader, viewer, I invite you to take a moment and reflect on your personal journey alongside the characters. What memories stand out? Which moments touched your heart? How has the show touched your life, whether through shared laughter, empathetic tears, or reflective pondering? Your thoughts are a testament to the enduring power of storytelling, reminding us that even as time moves forward, the impact of those stories stays with us, shaping who we are and who we become. So, let your memories and insights flow. Share your thoughts, for in doing so, you become a part of the ongoing narrative that makes Knott's Landing so enduringly special. Thank you for joining me on this exploration of Knott's Landing for investing your time, your heart, and your thoughts. Your connection to this series is a testament to the remarkable ability of television to leave a lasting imprint on our lives. Until we embark on our next journey into the world of storytelling, keep the spirit of Knott's Landing alive within you, and continue to find solace, inspiration, and connection in the stories that unfold around you. With gratitude for your time and interest.